Oh, good morning. Well, I wanted to see how the trailer worked in uh, high winds, and uh, right now we have a, yeah, it's called a blizzard, but we're not getting a lot of snow, but uh, really high winds, and uh, the heater worked great last night. I turned the propane on to kind of supplement the electric, and Oh, you know, you can keep it at any temperature you want. Really cooled it, or heated the trailer down nicely. A um, little bit of condensation on the windows, but I figure with the heat, uh, it's not bad. It really isn't bad. Wind blew hard. Uh, they had probably sustained winds 35 to 40. Gusts up to 60 is what I heard on the radio. And it, it rocked the trailer a little bit, um, but, uh, and there were a lot of gusts. Because I'd wake up in the night, you know, you could feel it rocking a little bit. But it wasn't bad. Um, I was a little concerned about high winds, but yeah, nothing. Yeah, I slept good. Um, everything worked great. There's more snow on the ground today, um, and it's blowing pretty good. They have visibility problems, but <clears throat> I don't think it's as bad as they thought it was going to be. Anyway, the uh, 17FQ did a great job in wind, and it was probably legitimate uh, 60 mile an hour gusts. I'd say it was close. Temperature in here, it's whatever I want to set it at. I've got the thermostat set pretty low. It's always nice, I think everybody knows, to supplement it with electric heat if you've got a, you know, if you're not boondocking. So, uh, great night's sleep, great trailer. Still have, at this point, nothing bad to say about it. Uh, stabilizer jacks held it nice and steady. Uh, you know, you could feel it, but it wasn't like rocking way back and forth. You could just, you could feel the wind blow. All right.